good morning class 1 so in the today's class we're gonna learn something about lines okay what are actually lines are and where the lines has been used okay where are the where the lines is being used okay and <clears throat> what are they called so so the first we have is the horizontal lines okay so if you see such line going from left to right or right to left okay these lines are called horizontal lines okay so if you see your exercises book if you see at your book you can you can find these horizontal lines okay in your exercise book and next is vertical line so if you if you see line coming from up to down or down to up it is a vertical lines okay and these are your slant line we call it slant lines okay and all of these all three of this is called straight line straight line so we use uh, we different shapes okay sorry if uh, there, if you can see over here there are different shapes like a square rectangle and a triangle all these are being created by connecting lines okay so as you can see in a square shape you will find there is a horizontal line as well as there this is your vertical line okay you have horizontal line here over here and you have vertical line over here so different uh, shapes are being created with the help of uh, connecting lines okay with by connecting lines you will get different shape likewise there is also a horizontal line and there is a vertical line in a triangle shape you will get there is a slant line and there is a horizontal line okay so okay so the next line we have is the curved lines okay so this you can see these all are in curved shape so these are called curved lines oh okay and the curved lines are used to uh, used to draw like circle and oval okay as you can see in the circle there is curve like this okay this it is this this shape of curve has been used in the circle see okay and also in oval see there is a curve shape being used in the uh, used to draw circle and oval shape okay let me give you some more examples so these are called curve lines okay so lines are not only used in uh, creating the shapes but they are also used in uh, letters like see if you have letters like this p s d b a see you can find lines like here there is a vertical shape here okay the lines which is present at p is a vertical here and there is a curve there is also a curve and vertical in the p letter and all these is a curve shape i am just writing c that's why you so that you will understand that th this means curved and v means vertical okay so there is also line present here like vertical 
and curve. This will be your curve. And one more there is see presence of vertical as well as there is a curve. Okay. But in the A letter you will find you will find slant line S L A N D slant line. These are all slant line and this will be your horizontal. Okay. So see lines are not only just used to make shapes and but they are also used in letters okay so let me give me uh, one more example like this okay so in the next example we have here is there is a leaf plate and a mug okay so we can find here there is a horizontal line in this leaf as well as there is a curve shape in the leaf okay so there is a uh, both are present in the shape of a leaf also here it's a curve shape okay in uh, the uh, the plate is look like a plate looks like a curve shape so it has a curve shape line and uh, one more example if you uh, if you look at the look at this mug there is also curve line present in this mug as well okay i hope you got the some idea about lines and curves okay okay so let's do some uh, exercises uh, first is your vertical lines so in the vertical line your question is trace the dotted lines to form rainfall use blue color to trace the dotted lines okay as you can see in the picture over here i have made two clouds with some dotted lines and you have to use your blue color see blue color to trace the dotted lines okay so to form a rainfall so you have to use blue color in this the dotted line and you have to trace wherever it is uh, the rainfall is being uh, okay so you can see I have uh, you use blue color to trace your dotted line which makes the uh, rainfall okay which looks like a ver vertical lines okay Okay, uh, we will do some more exercise in the next coming class. Okay, that's all for now. Thank you.